Uh, the land conference, as I said yesterday, is a, is a constitutionally sanctioned um, event because, uh, you know, the power of the people um, is what determines the outcome of how we need to govern the country. And so it's a perfect opportunity for the Namibian people to express their views on questions pertaining to land, land use, land distribution, um, land acquisition, the ownership of property and so forth. And so I think for that purpose, it's a very, very important opportunity for us to speak. Um, mm -hmm. and, and like we've been saying, and the president set the tone when he spoke on the first day, is let the people speak. And I think that is the approach that we've been taking with all the sessions that we've been having at the land conference. Mm -hmm. um, now, some of the issues, and I think it's on that basis that the land conference working groups have been divided as well, is for, for us as, as lawyers and as the Law Reform and Development Commission, of course the issues around the constitutional implications of all the issues that will be discussed, whether it is the questions around urban land, questions around communal land, uh, questions around ancestral land claims, um, all of those issues are of interest to us, particularly mm -hmm. because the, the discussions around the land conference are predicated on, on a number of frameworks. Mm -hmm. It's your uh, land Communal Land Reform Act, the Constitution, it's the various policies, land policy, resettlement policy. So because of the implications that it has, because mm -hmm. once this discussion has taken place and the policy has been set out, what we will have to do as the Law Reform and Development Commission, but also as the various ministries, particularly the, the Land Reform Ministry, we will have to go back to the drawing board mm -hmm. and say, this is what the people have been saying, this is how the issues have been articulated. Yeah. What is it that we need to change? What were the problems? Because if right. we did not have a problem, mm -hmm. we would not be sitting where we are finding ourselves today. So for us as the Law Reform and Development Commission, all the issues that will be discussed at the conference are of interest to us because we want to see how we can improve the law, um, how we can change some of the old laws. Mm -hmm. We have been criticized, and I think it's a fair criticism mm -hmm. that we have failed um, to change, particularly some of the antiquated and old laws um, that have driven some of the problems that we're seeing today. So for us, the interest is, is global. Remember, government has various institutions. Um, of course, cabinet, uh, president being the head of cabinet, um, will probably be the first body that will look at the recommendations and the resolutions that will come from the conference. So there will certainly be a list of resolutions, a, you know, so people will go back and, and, and put them together. Um, and then that will in most probably go to cabinet. Cabinet has a directive, uh, as it mm -hmm. does in, as part of its governance architecture, and what will happen probably is that it will go back to the Ministry of Land Reform, because land reform administers this part uh, of our work. Um, there are other interested institutions, such as the Law Reform and Development Commission. If there mm -hmm. are particular legislative um, activities that needs to happen, uh, we may have to be considered. I think the Office of the Prime Minister uh, has a role to play. Um, I don't think the high-level committee that was established through the Office of the Prime Minister's mm -hmm. job will end when the conference, when the conference ends. ends. So there's a number of institutions and processes, I think, yeah. um, that, are, that have been put in place mm -hmm. that will ensure that you know there is some form of of monitoring uh, of progress so that we ensure that whatever decisions that we make mm -hmm. um, uh, will be implemented because I don't think people uh, would want to see a, a talk shop we don't want to right. wait another 27 years I don't believe